in order to find your way through all of that, you need to develop a relationship with something that's profound. And you can, you have that capacity. And what could be more profound than the truth? And what would you rather have on your side? And to do more than your best, because your best isn't enough, because your best isn't as good as you could be. You have to push yourself past that. And, and that's, as far as I can tell, where you find what you need in life. You find the meaning that sustains you in life, and you find the patterns of action that redeem the world. Nietzsche said that you could tell much about a man's character by how much truth he could tolerate, which is very interesting. You know, there's an, an idea in, 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 the, in the great Western tradition that the truth is the way and the path of life and that no one comes to the Father except through the truth. And I believe that to be the case because I don't think that you can manifest who you are without the truth. And so I think it's, it's, it's literally and metaphorically true that the pathway to who you could be if you were completely who you were is through the truth. And so the truth does set you free, but the problem is, is that it destroys everything that isn't worthy in you as it sets you free. And that's, that's a process of burning. And it's, it's painful because you cling to what you shouldn't be, um, partly out of pride and partly out of ignorance and partly out of laziness. like it's gonna work. What I'm gonna probably do, I seen a spare rim and tire on Amazon, I think for like 154 scale. I'm gonna buy one and we'll always have it back up. Well, if I have a flat on the job, I can jack it up, change it, keep going. It's currently eight o'clock, like 8.15. I know my neighbors wanna kill me. Part of business, catch y'all on the next one. True, and you all know this, you all know this perfectly well, because when was the last time that you learned something important that wasn't a, a blow of, of some sort, you know? And, and it's often you look back at your life and you think, oh God, I really learned something there. I wouldn't want to do that again, but it really changed my life. I mean, sometimes it can really destroy you, you know, an encounter with the truth and you never really recover. But now and then something comes along and straightens you out and a lot of you has to go. A lot of you has to burn away. You know, and, and, and I suppose in some sense the idea is that everything about you that isn't worthy is to be put into the flames. And that's, that's another reason to be not so casual about claiming what you believe, because it isn't something that you undertake without due caution. You know, I learned when I was a kid, about 25 or so, a little older than a kid, 